Days of Our Lives spoilers reveal that E.J. Diamera will remain firm in his stance against Sarah Karayakis and Xander Cook. Although Sarah is attempting to retract her statement against Brady Black, E.J. refuses to accept her change of heart. He is determined to hold Brady to the 10-year plea deal they made. Xander, frustrated by E.J.'s refusal, will likely lash out, but his efforts won't change E.J.'s mind. This is a significant problem for Sarah and Xander, as Brady's freedom is the only way to obtain the potential paralysis cure from Kristen Diemera and Dr. Wilhelm Rolf. Meanwhile, Eric Brady will confront Fiona Cook and demand the truth about her involvement in Sarah's hit-and-run accident. With the waiter's confirmation that Fiona left with Brady that night, Eric will accuse her of being responsible. However, Fiona will deny any involvement, pointing out that Eric has no solid proof, leaving him at an impasse but determined to continue fighting for Brady's freedom. Elsewhere, Maggie Kiriakis will catch up with Julie Williams, who will share updates about Chad Diemera's trip to Paris with Abigail Diemera. Julie will express hope that this trip will trigger more of Abigail's memories. However, Abigail will continue her charade, pretending to regain memories and even proposing marriage to Chad. All the while, Abigail will be carrying out Clyde Weston's plans. During a prison visit, Clyde will give Dr. Mark Green new orders, which include shocking news that leaves Mark rattled. Clyde wants Mark to kill Chad as the next phase of their scheme, despite Mark's protests. Clyde's goal is for an Abigail to become a widow, allowing her to inherit a portion of the Diemera fortune, which would eventually give her control over the entire empire. However, the plan could spiral out of control as both Nabigail and Mark face more trouble than they anticipated.